Hello. A cat's feeling her. We always uh, felt that a cat somehow knows when we are not feeling well and even where it hurts. Got a headache and the cat just seems to wrap around your head. A stomach ache and the cat cannot seem to get off your abdomen and purrs and purrs and purrs. It was always believed that a cat's purr was relaxing or stress reducing. Now science has shown that the cat's purr is much more than just relaxing. Remember that it is not just the sound of purring that is important, but more the tremor or vibration it produces. Interestingly, science has shown and known for many years that vibrations at specific levels or frequencies cause healing changes in the body. They can, for example, induce bone growth and regeneration. Bone fractures heal faster and weakened bones begin to strengthen and rebuild. Also, in the higher frequency ranges, the production of the body's own natural anti-inflammatory compounds increases, thereby reducing joint pain and swelling. There is further evidence of muscle, tendon and ligament repair within these frequency ranges as well, which has led to some popularity in sports medicine and gyms around the world, especially in the former Soviet Union where so much of this research was conducted. But it took researcher Elizabeth von Mugenthaler of the Fauna Communications Research Institute in North Carolina, a specialist in the field of bioacoustic, bio bioacoustics, to put it all together. Bioacoustics is the study of the frequency, pitch, loudness, and duration of animal sound as it relates to the animal's behavior. Based on her research, she proposed that nature has endowed all kinds of felines with an evolutionary healing advantage in the simple act of purring. The science behind the purr. She recorded and then measured the pair of 44 felids, members of the cat family, including cheetahs, ocelots, pumas, domestic cats, and servals. Cats from your house, pet to lions and tigers in the wild, generally pair in the range of 20 to 140 hertz. Some are as high as 150 hertz, but the average house cat comes in at about 25 and 50 hertz. Research has already shown that exposure to frequencies at that same uh, 20 and 50 hertz level induces increased bone density. In one study, for example, chickens were placed daily on a vibrating plate for 20 minutes, which resulted in stronger bone growth. It's National Geographic. Further, in 1994, Dr. Chen and his associates, working with rabbits, determined the frequencies of 25 and 50 hertz promoted bone strength by 20%, stimulating both the mechanism and speed of fractured healing. There is even a popular saying among, amongst veterinarians. If you put a cat and a bunch of broken bones in the same room, the bones will heal. There is also substantial documentation that low frequency vibration induces pain relief and healing of tendons and muscles, and cats purr at those very same frequencies. Vibration per therapy. The extrapolation of uh, this research may prove vital. Studies continue uh, regarding tissue exposure to frequencies between 20 and 50 Hz. For, for example, Dr. Clinton Rubin in a 1999 study discovered that such exposure creates the robust situations of increased bone density, suggesting application for osteoporosis, particularly in postmenopausal women and elderly. But it's the cat's healing by association that most people find interesting. That ability of a cat to sympathetically help cure illnesses in people simply by being around them. Studies have also shown that owners, especially senior citizens, who have cats have lower uh, blood pressure and can live longer than humans who don't own pets. Many injured individuals swear they can ease or completely eliminate their migraine headaches simply by lying down with a purring cat next to their head. Can't hit the minimum recommended daily dose of bone energy calcium Maybe grabbing the next uh, nearest cat and holding it close may just prove to be an answer to beautiful bones. Having surgery, perhaps after coming home, keeping a cat nearby will reduce your recovery time. So, go get a cat. Keep it happy and purring. You are both likely to be healthier and you'll have a great friend who truly understands how you are feeling. Best regards.